Walmart. Right over there to our left. We're at this little mall and Paul truck stop. It wasn't very much to show you last night because it was kind of it was dark, right? A little bit of rain. And uh but it looks like it's gonna be a nice sunny day today. We're gonna fix in the row, aren't we guys? Are we gonna get ready to go? Hmm? Yeah. We gotta get ready to go bye bye, don't we? Yeah. We gotta get ready to go bye bye. Gonna get ready to go. And we'll be right back. Alright, let's leave the bicycle stand. Monroe, Georgia. That is where I'm at right now. This doesn't happen very often, man, because right there is the Walmart. Right there. Right across that fence over there. But having a truck stop so close to a Walmart. That doesn't happen very often. There's another one not too far from this other Walmart. We're going to uh, Ridgeland. I think that's what you call it. Ridge or Pageland. P-A-G-E. L-A-N-D, one word, Pageland, South Carolina. Yeah, this is Bogart, Georgia. We're on 78. Headed east. Sometimes I like running off the interstate. I got a comment the other day on one of my videos. It says taking the uh, off road, the back road, is a drag because it slows you down. But when you have plenty of time, that's okay. Because really, this is what America is all about, is these towns going through the woods here. It's not the interstate. The interstate, yeah, everything is a hustle and bustle and everything is, we gotta go, but you know what? Everybody and their brother has to travel on that interstate. Look, there ain't hardly anybody on this road, but I bet you the interstate is bumper to bumper and probably barely moving. <coughs> I'll make better time going through the woods here than I would actually taking the interstate. You don't have to take my word for it. Anybody that drives for a living knows I'm just about telling the truth here. I got a traffic light here and there, but you know what? We're moving. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, we're going to be getting on I-85. We're going to get off this... Uh,
I'll be at that Walmart at 3.55 I know it's wrong totally wrong because uh, it said 3.14 Rhonda's trying to take me around <coughs> but we're at this I don't know if they really got a restaurant here or not last time I was here they didn't have one They time before that they did have one and they closed it down now they claim they do have one so it says mexican food oh. let's see what they got
think it's at 10 minus. Yep, that's what minus it's at. 10. Yeah. And then we got a minus 10. And then next, and then next, and then next, and then next, and then next. And then next. They still got Walmart unloaded, although they don't have lumpers, you know. Yeah, I know. We trying, we trying to get the perfection. We doing the best we can do. I know, yeah. You know, you know we, the Walmart kind of suffered. They poor company. It's been a while. Huh? I didn't think Amazon was killing you guys that much. I hope they ain't. I need a job. <laughs> I hear you. All right, you just come in, brother. Uh -huh. Me and you talking right here. Come on down to the H zone back in here. Walk over 317. What's your temperature? Minus 10? Minus 10. You can be down here on the freezer. Once they give you one of them doors slide the tenders over here, dollar down this connect for the that trailer, chop these other tires. You look like the old KW sitting there. What do you do, sir? Don't pull out the door. We'll just let it call you. When she does walk over here, get your paperwork, come back to your rear. Make sure you got that green light and paperwork. Come back out here and we'll check you out, brother. All right. You be safe now. Call you All right. He called my pen a shocking pen. He said, you got one of those shocking pens, right? Yep. <laughs> Whatever he meant by that. You gotta go to H. I gotta call Mike, see if there's anybody close by. I don't know if they can work on it here. I'm gonna, when I call up there to let them know I dropped, I'm gonna ask them, can I get, uh, can road service come in here and fix my tire? Cause I'm gonna be here for a couple hours. Anyway. So I'll be right back. Wait, you want to put that in? Is this? This one's mine, ain't it? Okay. You may not be, I, that's why I said I don't know. I know, I figured you might be good, but I don't think we're good on this one. I don't know why I don't hook up. Uh -huh. <laughs> Yeah. 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 So I want you to go get the door one three eight. Slide your cam, talk to yeah. your cousin Dolly Dan and give me a call. Yeah. Alright, thank you. 138. Yeah. 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 There we go. We're at our <coughs> we're at our pickup, and this is actually going to Nebraska, to York, Nebraska. I didn't really film coming here because it was dark, very dark. We took a lot of back roads, and it was dark. Uh, but I sh I showed you we had a flat. Uh, I recall seeing a piece of metal in the road i i thought i dodged it i saw it i didn't even hit it i, I didn't want to hit it with my steer tire right so i dodged it but apparently the side of that metal got the side of my tire and that's 
it didn't blow it it just cut it uh, but it it missed the other tires so brand new tire and I had to put I had to actually get a tire but well, I'm gonna show you guys something anyway I'm fixing to have another, another cup of coffee did you know that pilot makes coffee for the Carrick machine they do see pilot this is pretty cool I bought two boxes well I got Pilot, Folgers, and looky here, I even got two boxes of Timmy's. Yep, I got another box of Timmy's right there. That's my last box of Folgers, but I got another Pilot house back there. But uh, $3.99 for Pilot. And I'll show you. They actually come in this uh, aluminum sealed bag I don't know why they do that I mean they must be afraid that it's gonna go bad right see little Kirk thingy just set that in there I gotta make sure I got water let me okay okay I did the doggy treat Woo, you almost fell, buddy. Get back up here. Come on. Now settle down. You almost fell. You're gonna break your you're gonna break a leg. Now stop. I'm looking for it. Uh, stop now. I'm trying to find the opening. There. Hey. It's okay. It's okay. I get hey, daddy get you more doggy treats. I promise I will, okay? I promise I will. We're in there. But right, anyways, we're, we're out of here for... today. I want to thank you guys for watching. And uh, with that being said, God bless. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Catch you tomorrow. Later.